First to learn weather with meteorologist Spencer Blum. Like Blake mentioned, I'm very happy today after the Florida State victory over LSU. You know what else makes me happy though? Seeing temperatures in the low 80s at almost 11 o'clock at night. Right now it's 83 degrees at the airport. Humidity is still slightly elevated, but overall not too bad. Seeing that dew point right now of 57 degrees. So slightly on the more humid side, but it's not necessarily feeling muggy out there, which is nice. And temperatures across the valley, speaking of nice, I mean, take a look at this. We have temperatures in the low 80s across the valley. Right now it's 80 degrees here in Thousand Palms as well as in Palm Desert. 84 in Indio and Thermal and 83 up in Palm Springs. So very nice and mild night for us here in the Coachella Valley. Air quality. I mentioned this a few minutes ago. Yes, it is definitely very hazy out there. We're really seeing those gusts and we're seeing lots of sand and dust getting picked up as well. I'm not 100% sure why it's not being reflected on our air quality map, at least why the entire valley is not showing up as having some sort of air quality impact. But although it only says that there's an air quality impact, a moderate one at that in the uh, eastern half of the valley, it is still very dust gusty out there and it's picking up dust and we are seeing some visibility concerns. So just keep that in mind. As we look at our future track wind gust, we can see that it's going to stay fairly gusty throughout the evening hours and even overnight as well. It's going to stay gusty. Tomorrow morning, those winds are going to calm down a little bit, but I am tracking a pickup in those winds once again as we head into tomorrow afternoon. You can see but by noon tomorrow, we're already seeing wind gusts in excess of 10 miles an hour for much of the eastern half or eastern, eastern two thirds of the valley, I should say. And then those wind gusts are only going to continue to pick up as we move through the afternoon. Today, we saw temperatures well below average because we're still feeling a little bit of an impact from that trough I mentioned the other day, but that's moving out of our area. And in its place, you can see we have this ridge of high pressure, which is building toward our southeast. And this is really going to kick off on Wednesday. And then by Thursday, we're going to see that ridge start to move into the desert southwest. And like I've mentioned a bunch of times, ridges tend to lead to higher temperatures. But tomorrow, it's going to be very mild as well. Going to start off in the upper 60s and the low 70s. And then we're going to pick up toward that triple degree mark, probably in the later afternoon, closer to four o'clock in the afternoon. Then as we look at the first alert comfort air seven day forecast, occasional gusts continue tomorrow as we have a gradual warming trend over the next few days, peaking this weekend with temperatures a few degrees above average. But once we get through the warmer temperatures of this weekend, we can expect a slight drop in our temperatures as we head into next week. You're watching News Channel 3, the desert's news leader.